A particle's acceleration is given by a t square i hat plus b t j hat, where a and b are constants, t is time, i hat and j hat are the unit vectors corresponding to x and y axis, respectively. The particle starts the motion at rest and at the origin. So initially we have uh, starting the motion at rest and at the origin. Uh, find the velocity and position vector of the particle as a function of time. So let's start by noting that we have an initial condition. Velocity at t is equal to 0 is 0. The position at t is equal to 0 is 0. Okay. Now what is the relationship between velocity and acceleration? dv dt, the rate of change of uh, velocity is equal to acceleration or instantaneous acceleration as a function of time and therefore the change in the velocity delta v is the integral from 0 to t acceleration at time t prime dt prime so this is my dummy variable so this is going to be equal to integral from 0 to t a t prime square i hat plus b t prime j hat dt prime. So this will be a t prime cube divided by 3 i hat plus b t prime square divided by 2 j hat which will be evaluated between time t equals 0 to t and therefore the change in velocity, velocity at time t minus velocity at time t equals to 0 this is basically equal to velocity at uh, time t this is equal to velocity at time t because at 0 we have uh, the particle at rest uh, this is going to be equal to a t cube a t cube over 3 i hat plus b t square over 2 j hat. So this is our velocity vector. Now... <clears throat> The velocity is related to the position vector. Uh, the rate of change of position vector uh, with time, the r dt, this is equal to velocity by definition. And therefore, the displacement delta r is integral from 0 to t, v t prime dt prime so this will be integral from 0 to t a t prime cube divided by 3 i hat plus b t prime square divided by 2 j hat dt prime so once again we integrate uh, and we obtain a t prime to the fourth power divided by 12. So 3 times 4, 12 i hat. And we obtain b t prime cube divided by uh, 6 j hat, which will be evaluated between time t equals 0 to t. So the position, change in position vector, the displacement r at time t minus r at time t equals 0 is equal to r at time t because we have the motion starting at the origin. So this will be equal to a t to 4 over 12 i hat plus b t cube over 6 j hat.